guys, Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 11 of 227, so let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. And I'm guessing all that had to change when she met me as a kid. But, okay, it makes sense why Nicole would keep this a secret for now, but then it makes me wonder why you didn't say anything when she saw her the first time. Maybe it's because of the fact that Miu has been so shy and quiet and to herself. It's a possibility that she possibly just forgot about meeting Nicole and knowing that Nicole was in the same class as her. There's a button. It's just quiet and do herself.
They only did it so you can talk. children such little bitches I mean oh my god That's fine. You're going to be the best damn witch you could ever be. <laughs> now, if you was a tree, you're going to be the best damn tree. If you was, I don't know, whoever, a dwarf, you're going to be the best damn dwarf, no matter what. That's the best thing about doing a play. What the fuck they gonna do to her? <laughs> These little issues took the damn apples. No, don't cry. Oh. There you go. Me will be in the best damn squirrel that she can. That's okay. You did good, Nicole. Mm -mm. Of course, this is your friend. Hello, kind of. That's why. So 
that's gotta be the guy's reason why she doesn't need a chimney or whatever you. And she's gotten all this because of me. I was like, oh my god. But when you saw her present day, I'm guessing you were still shocked about that. But think about it. Look how far she's come ever since because of me. Of course. It's been such a long ass time. No, I'm guessing she's going to need them then. Back up. I don't need you to hurt yourself. Cody, no. Please move. I don't need you to hurt yourself. Come on. It, please. Now, if the wall freaking speaks to her, you okay? You got hiccups. The fact that she was still singing and dancing.
The wall was waiting for this, wasn't it? Because watch, wall going to say something. We all know it's going to happen. Okay. Yeah, we well, you know you don't even need to say. That was a tough episode. Like, oh, the fact that she did that still all by herself. My God, Jan.
Yep. See, I would not have been surprised by the end of this episode, and they still could do it now, if the wall spoke and said, get back to them. But this was a really good episode of my best girl. I'm happy for her. I'm glad that because of the way, because I always wondered, I was like, okay, how did this girl get this big uh, confidence from herself and everything? And it was really because of me. Seeing her as a little kid and being someone who was stuttering and in the end because of one thing that me even kicked the shit out of that little girl I mean damn I do the same thing too but it was nice I mean me was the best damn squirrel that she could be Nicole was the best witch even though they didn't get to see the rest of the pig because of the freaking me and what me you did but you know what Snow White and her two friends deserve that ass whooping. I'm sorry. Even though Snow White was the main one who got her butt kicked. I'm just saying. But it was good. I get the fact. But it would have been nice that Miu could have remembered her at the end of this episode. But maybe I feel like in this next episode, what I think is the last episode, I think. Um, that Nicole goes up to her and talks about that fateful day and then maybe that's how me be like i remember you now i mean that would make so much sense i'm just saying i told you i told you <laughs> That's it. Mr. Wall, hold the fuck up. <laughs> I'm like, we're in episode one all over again. Okay. So now this is going to be their official debut once again as a group reunited together again. I don't know. I'm I'm a little at a crossroads. I'm happy now that they're going to be officially back together. But then you got to think about all these other fans. And now. Um, is Sakura going to call her dad. And be like hey you know. Now I got to cancel my trip. Come back home. Because um, the unit decided to read. <laughs> but I think everything. That happened from last week. To this week. It all happened for a reason. Two, I get the fact that Nicole was the last girl that we had to really focus on a backstory. And now since everyone has had their backstories out and we now know everything about them. And so we get to see the other three girls who have not been mentioned in this show in the OVA that'll be out later on this summer. Um, I'm guessing like still, if it's a possibility, they could have these three girls who are going to be in the OVA possibly in this last episode. I'm not 100% sure. We just got to find out until we get to next Saturday and we'll see. But, um, 
I don't know. I mean, I hope this performance, because it seems like they're going to possibly do performance this last time for this last episode, it's good. I hope that the fans understand the situation of what happens. I don't think they're really going to give them the benefit of the doubt, but as someone who does support a group, they're going to have questions and they're going to be like, well, if I support you guys again and if you break up again, what's the point, you know? It'd be like, it makes no sense for me to support you again, to know what somewhat down the line you're just going to break up possibly again. But honestly, you're never really truly going to know what in the world is going to happen next. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 11 of 227. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for the finale. Bye, guys.